Spurgeon here with Revzilla TV to talk to you about the HJC CLX7 Zilla graphic available at Revzilla.com. Now, the CLX7 is going to be the updated version of the CLX6, and there's a ton of new things going on in this helmet. The graphic is going to be the Zilla graphic. It's a departure from the more speed oriented kind of line graphic that we've seen from HJC, and they've gone into more of an illustrative graphic with this particular piece. Now, as far as the CLX7 is concerned, you're looking at a polycarb shell, slightly on the heavy side, but what you get with that is a DOT Snell rated helmet, sub $150, a lot of bargain baked in there. Now, as far as the fit for this overall helmet is concerned, it's gonna be intermediate oval, and what that means for you, a little bit longer front to back, and it's really gonna work great for about 90% of the American market out there. So again, when you're looking at this particular helmet, if you want more information, we do have a detailed breakdown. Make sure to check it out and watch all the nitty gritty on the CLX7 if you're not already familiar with it. Now, as far as this graphic is concerned, it's really gonna start with the top and work its way through. So first and foremost, you're gonna have this giant three-headed demonic looking creature up on top. And it's also gonna have this nice tongue out HJC logo all throughout the front of the visor. And again, what you're really gonna notice here is they've gone with an illustrative graphic. Graphic. This is going to be something we really haven't seen HJC do too much of, and they've done it well. The whole thing looks hand painted, and you really see one asymmetry as you work your way through. You're going to have this kind of scorpion like logo as it works its way down through the back, and this scorpion tail is going to come out and it's going to work its way down to the right side. The left side are both going to be, again, symmetry throughout the entire piece. And you're really going to notice the blues contrasting against the oranges and the reds. Really nice, fine pinstriping. Really just overall, the colors on this are super vibrant. And it's really going to work well to give you the contrast of those hots and those colds when you're looking at the colors. Now, the HJC logo done up front, again, bright oranges and reds surrounded by the intense blue flame surrounding it and it's going to work its way through. Again, this helmet to me, it's like a designer from a 90s Gwar video came up with the wackiest idea possible and hand painted this over the entire helmet. Really nice job and it continues throughout the back. As we bring it around, you're going to have this two-headed demon looking thing with bat wings. Now it looks like they've taken a cue from an Ozzy Osbourne video. I think I saw a t-shirt like this once at Ozfest. Again, throughout the entire piece, there's not going to be a lot of reflectivity with this. There's not going to be a lot of metal flake. It's going to be solid paint schemes. But again, there's a lot of contrasting with the light blues and the way it shades out into darker blues. Really just nicely done from HJC. Now, like I said in the beginning, the CLX7 is going to be a really nice entry level to mid level dirt helmet. And there's a lot of folks out there rocking the CLX7. If you want to hear more about what they have to say, do me a favor, click the info button. Read what other riders are digging on the CLX7s they're rocking on their rides. If you have more questions for us, never hesitate. Get us on the phone, give us a call, 877-792-9455, or simply type us out an email, cs at ribzilla.com. Thank you for joining us for this look at the HJC CLX7 Zilla graphic. I'm Spurge. Enjoy the ride.